Hello everybody, welcome back. My name is Rule of Nine, and this is Amnesia the Dark Descent. We're gonna get right into the game today. Uh, get right into the spooks. Right, spook ourselves right out of Spookzone. Into Spook Town. With spooky babies on the screen, and... Like, that's... I, oh yeah, I actually remember that face. That was a face that was on that water phone, and I called it Mom. Um... You gotta say, I'm not ready for this. Come this way. Some rumors, What was that? Forgive me, I should have warned you. One of my responsibilities as a baron is that of a prison warden. Really? This is where criminals are locked up. Like a thing? Very much so. Come, don't linger. Come on. Secret door. Hmm. Okay. Okay, whatever you say, game. Oh, fuck. Fuck, God damn it. Was I supposed to run in there? Man, I suck. Can you follow me in here? Yes. Yeah, how about now? What, what? What? What you gonna do? What you gonna do, huh? You can't follow me in here. Oh, maybe you can. Ah, oh, yeah, there's no way you can follow me. There's no way you can move all stuff out of the way. I can barely move this stuff. You're a little bitch, aren't you? Okay, so... I know an easy way to... to Yeah, look at you. Look at you. You think you're scary looking? You think you're actually scary? Wow, that's... that's sad. Man, like, what are you doing with your life, man? He's not happy. Wait, did he just, like, not even know I was there? And I can't... okay. Because I couldn't do anything there. I had trapped myself. Um... Responsibilities as a baron is that of a prison warden. Sickle BS. This is where criminals are locked Oop. up. Like a dungeon? Very much so. Come, don't linger. Come on, open the dang door. Okay, so. So we know we don't go that way. I guess he's gonna be this way anyway. He's just gonna be whatever way I go. What the hell? It's not weird or anything. Hmm. Broom. That's a hammer. I can tell it is. Oil, that's always nice. Oh, yeah, 17 uh, thingies, so that's good. Oh, fuck. Should I be running away? I see a spook in there. Okay, spook's gone. Okay. So I can't go that way. Oh, that was weird. Oh, it's like really. It's, it's kind of insane. Yeah, okay. Oh, uh... All is good. Man, your sanity is still... Man, you suck. Oh my god, you suck. You're so bad at this. I think we're safe. I think we're good here. I think I'm gonna go. I think my guy's gonna literally go insane. Oh. 
Man, this sucks. Like this slow turning crap sucks. Come on, come on. Oh, I get I just hammer it. Where is she? Where did she go? No. Oh, tell. What's that? You're just making things worse. A chipper. Oh, I probably needed that too. This is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what. Do I combine these? Horrors are way down there. Is this. Oh, sweet. Why is there some random oil in here? Is that the only purpose of that? God damn it, god damn it. Why he teleported, didn't he? That's what that means. That means he's teleported. He's teleporting, I can hear him. Fuck. That means I'm super insane now, right? Is that what that means? No. Oh, this is where I damn it, this is where I started. Man, I'm going I'm so crazy right now. This like insanity thing it sucks. Fuck, he's damn it, he found me. This floating chair here probably won't help my cause either. Something. No. Strange. What's this? Did I just really block the door? Come on. Lights are nice. I like you. But mother, I don't want to leave without you. Hurry, child. You must go. Find Gabriel, the outlet, and tell him to alert the king's men. No, you come too. Please, we don't have time to make the hole any wider. 
Or did they go under? Hurry! I'll cover the hole with the bed. Ah. Everything will be fine. I promise. Thank you. I finally got out of this dumb place. I was about to freaking flip about because I went through just freaking darkness. Am I still incredibly insane? Yeah, I'm still like laggy. Insane. What? What? Can I hammer it? Thank you. I was gonna say. The dark towers of Brandenburg rose above the forest and were silhouetted against the snow white moon. He couldn't feel helping. He couldn't feel something for some reason. Oh, good. Ah, crystal clear. Hell yeah. I, was, I, was, I, was, my, I myself was about to go insane. So, that's good. Oh, what if these holes weren't weren't wide enough though? I have to hammer these out all by myself. Oh man, it'd be pretty cheap if a spookman came after me down here. I can't really do much. Okay, keep a rock with me just in case some motherfucker wants to come at me. What about a drill, huh? Hey, you! Stop! Don't come any closer! I just want to leave! You can't go outside! It's too dangerous! I'm telling Gabriel! That's where I, I came from. Oh, that's a good hiding spot right there, though. One thing I don't know is that once you get away from the guy, does he despawn until you hear the noise again? If I knew that, then that would allow me to play the game a lot easier. Like, if I could... There's a note there. 2nd of August, 1839. <laughs> I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. 
I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Oh shit, now we're back to fucking Terror Town. Wrong side of town, Daniel. Wrong side of town. You just shut that door behind you. Okay, so we're chucking. Uh, is that rock too big to chuck at him? Damn it, it's a fucking dead end. Fuck! Ah! Oh, they're out of the fucking way, motherfucker. Give me this rug. Give me this rug. Come on, that's fucking too big to rock. Now I'm back to. Ah! Now he tells he's gonna teleport in front of me because he's a little bitch. Gonna find me. Should have ran the other way. My sanity's waning because, you know, he's a little wussy. <laughs> Fuck, there he is. Fuck, run! I really suck at key placement. Perfect. Glass jar. Need some of that lantern tea or whatever. That was crystal clear earlier. This is where I was, and it was a dead end. Absolutely. This is where I was before that, there was nothing. So I picked up this glass jar. An empty glass container. Gate leading out of the area looks like it's worn. So I've obviously been here. Yeah. Because my barrels are right there. Oh, there we go. Perfect. 3rd of August, 1839. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic creation perched upon a forest clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well versed in worldly matters and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite, and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenberg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. 
Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Ooh. Come on. Some more oil. I did a lot of oil. Wow, I am. Ooh, oh. You know, I kind of thought it would do that automatically, fucker. I thought my guy would, would assume. Oh. Okay, here he comes. There's no way he finds me, right? I'm hiding behind the Bay of Pigs. I guess there's like a lean up button. I can't uncrouch here. Looks like I'm good. And I've got quite a bit of oil in there too, so I'm looking good for the moment. Now I gotta find my way back. And I don't even know which lock it would be that I'd have to break. I'm assuming it's the weak one that I found. And I don't exactly remember where that is. Wait. Maybe that means I don't want to go that way. I don't want to do that one. Well, actually, no, we're right next to it. We're right next to the place, so... Okay, good. Good, that narrows it down. It's this way with the fucker. Gotta enter Spookman now. Here is Tom Fuckery. I wish I had fucking perfect memory. Oh, is it this one? Is it this? Yes, I think it's this. Fuck, fuck, open. They open the goddamn door. He's right behind. Me. I wonder if he could, he could have broke, even broken down that metal door. Now it's all crystal clear. Thank you. You know, honestly, I, I have I have no reason for me to be able to speak for the rest of the game. But honestly, I don't find him in particular scary anymore. He he's not scary. Like that's all I gotta say about that.